Hello everyone, welcome once again in Cool IT Help. In this tutorial session, we are going to download and install Selenium on Mac OS X Catalina. Also, we will set up Chrome driver in Eclipse. So guys, first we will focus on the prerequisite. We need Java 8 or later version. You can check your machine, Java is installed or not. Also, we need one Eclipse IDE. You can use any version of Eclipse. Now, the third and important one is Selenium jars. So, there are some uh, set of jars which is required to write Selenium automation script. So, we will download from this link. After that, we will follow these five steps to complete the installation. Let's start with the step one. In the step one, we need to download Selenium jar and their supporting jar files. We will use this link, same link given in the description so you can get there. Now open your Chrome browser or any browser you have visited this link and you will be landed on this page. This is the official download page from the Selenium and you can get the trusted jar files for our Java automation script. Now under this section, just in front of that we have a download link so guys please click on it. And one zip file will start downloading you can see on the left corner and the size is not big only 7.2 MB in size so this will not take much time. Okay guys so this is downloaded we have placed it somewhere at a safest place. I have placed here in a separate folder. Now let me uh, take you inside the folder. So here we will unzip this file. So just double click here and uh, you will see one folder. Expand the tree and you will find these two important jar files. Also we have more jar files inside this lips folder. So we will include all these in the Java project in the next step. So we finished our step one. Now we are going to start with step two. In the step two we will create a one Java project inside the Eclipse, then we will add the Selenium jar path in this project. Here we go, this is the Eclipse and now go to the file menu, click new and select the new Java project from these menu items. Click next. Okay, at this place, just type a simple name for your Java project. So I am giving first selenium script and uh, as you can see we are using a uh, java 15 which is default detected by the eclipse now click next and now at this stage click next and finally you will see your project is ready on left hand side here the gre is associated and now we can create our java class here but before creating the Java class, our important task is to import these jars in the class path of this project. Do the right click, go to the properties. At this place on left side, click Java build path. Click on this libraries tab. And then click on the class path. After that, select all the jar files. One, two. and to add it now we will add more the remaining jars inside the lib file process is same clicking on ex import external jars select all jars click open and these are added here now we can simply press apply and close after that you can see all your libraries important libraries will refer here through this node referenced libraries now guys we have done the step and now it's time to create a new class file do right click select new and create a class file with the name of your choice and uh, check here so you will get a main method inside it Okay, now it's time to write a simple code. First, we will load system properties and we will load the Chrome driver. Before going to write the code inside the Eclipse, we will finish our step four. Here we 
have to do one important thing if you want to visit a chrome browser if you want to visit a website through the chrome browser then we have to download chrome driver.exe file which will be compatible for the mac os x if you guys working on the uh, windows then you have a different version if you are working with the mac you have to download different one so we will visit this web link and here we will download the chrome driver now at this place we have to check which driver we have to download go to this about chrome and then you will get the right version this version is 89.0 so we will download the matching version chrome driver from this page you can see the latest one is our target because our chrome version is 89 now I will just click here on this link if you guys have a matching with the 88 just download the second one once you click on this link you will be redirected to this page at this place we have some zip file so we will select the second one chrome driver underscore mac 64 zip this is the right version click on it downloading will start and this will not take much time only 8 MB in size it is just downloaded so guys keep this file at the safest place because we have to give the path of this in the program so I have just extracted and we placed it in our selenium installation folder on the desktop now the chrome driver is downloaded now we simply uh, move to our coding section in the eclipse because we want to visit the www.coolithelp.com so we need some code here is the code now i will take you inside the eclipse code is pasted now look at the line number eight this is the important step first we have to load the chrome driver.exe in the system property so we have to give this method system.set property there's a string for the driver name and after that we have to give the path of that chrome we will adjust it after doing some import of these classes okay this is fine now now we will replace this path in the previous step we have downloaded the chrome driver.exe so guys you have placed that uh, driver exe somewhere on your system so just get the path of that to get the path open the terminal and simply drag and drop that exe here so you will get the exact path so you can avoid the mistake in the path with the help of this trick so just copy the path from here and go back in the eclipse and update the path at this place okay and make sure you are not using the space in the folder name if you are using please remove that double slash okay check the path now it's time to run we will take the clean build of the system once you try to run you will get this message because chrome driver is not from the downloaded from the app store that's why we are getting this message so we will get this kind of error because this is not authorized by the apple system so what exactly we have to do now just go to the apple icon click on the system preferences in the security and privacy section you will see that message chrome driver was blocked because this is not from an identified developer at this place you have to click on this button allow anyway now to save the changes to accept this we have to click on this lock and this will ask you to authenticate whatever your system password so give the system password and save the changes now you have just allowed that to run chrome driver.exe and this will run without any problem on your mac now we will erase all the errors from this place again we will try to run it do the right click run as java application now finally you will see this message also you will get option to open click open and you will see chrome driver start loading also you will get the message 
in the console chrome driver was started successfully that means it's working fine now this will launch the chrome browser you can see selenium chrome browser is launched and you will see the message here chrome is being controlled by automated test software that means our selenium is working properly now the page is loaded as we have written in the script so guys this is the way you can uh, set up this selenium and you can run your test selenium test script with java uh, with the chrome driver so i hope you guys found this video tutorial relevant and useful and please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and guys for now thanks for watching cool it help